hey guys so today we are doing up close and personal <laughs> i'm going to be talking about the things that i used to do to my hair that if you give me one million naira now i'm not going to do it again <laughs> okay maybe that that's too much but you get my drift they are the things that i no longer do i no longer desire to do and i will no longer be doing ever again to my hair so if you're interested in this please stay on and keep watching by the way my name is florence if you're new here welcome welcome and if you're not welcome back to the channel let's begin So yeah, there are three major things that I would like to talk about that I have tried before on this channel. You've probably seen me say many beautiful things about it, but I will no longer be trying again. Number one is Chebe powder. <laughs> I know, I know. I mean, one of my most watched videos on this channel is about Chebe powder and I know I preached chibi powder and honestly I would tell you that chibi powder worked it worked for me honestly no cap it worked and the main job that chibi powder did was to moisturize my hair and keep it moisturized for long that way I am not getting a lot of breakage and my hair is growing that is basically what chibi powder did for me but will I try it again no definitely not there was too many assos with cherry powder there was a lot of um the cherry powder sand was dripping all over my all over the floor all over my clothes all over everywhere okay i couldn't do long-term protective styles with cherry powder and it was just too much of a hassle honestly besides there are better ways to keep my hair moisturized for longer nowadays i mean I love my new routine if you haven't if you don't know my new routine you can catch up here i'll leave it in the cards so i like my new routine it keeps my hair moisturized for as long as i want it and i can go about my life the way that i want it i can do whatever i want with my hair at any point that i want to and not be limited by the chibi powder regimen that i am following do you get my drift that's what i'm trying to say so even if you give me chibi powder for free right now i'm probably going to sell it that's the truth okay that's it that's it that's it anyways so will you be trying cherry powder again have you tried this did it work for you will you be trying it again let me know in the comment section below so another thing i will not ever be trying again is rice water i mean i wonder why i even ever tried it honestly <laughs> So rice water, what rice water did to my hair was to give it strength. That's basically it. Rice water strengthened my hair such that it wasn't easy for my hair to break, such that I retained more length. But why not just do a protein conditioner? Why not just use a good protein conditioner? That's my question for myself <laughs> and for you so i feel like a good protein conditioner would do the work rather than putting one smelly product in my hair oh my god rice water stinked and i still put it in my hair who sends me work anywho that is that about rice water in any form except it's in a properly made product I will not be trying the DIY rice water anymore, ever, 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 ever again, ever. <laughs> so the next thing on my list is DIYs. I know that a lot of people swear by DIYs and I have actually made a DIY conditioner on this channel that I actually really loved, but why? I mean, I don't know, but a lot of people love DIYs, but I have tasted the world of regular um, company-made products and I am never going back to DIYs and that is just it. <laughs> I'm not going back to DIYs. 
no i'm not not ever no matter the magic products are the claim that i can have to make this or that i'm i'm just not because i mean if you look at my routine now it's so simple i don't need those things besides and then look at my hair it's flourishing on its own i really do not need any of those things no just no never trying any diy ever again and that's it i mean i know that i have um had a couple of diys worked on this channel and honestly i believe that the things i said worked did what it did what i said that it did it's just that right now my priorities have changed i am now chasing a life of convenience baby girl lifestyle and i do not waste a whole day trying to wash my hair a whole day trying to concoct portions and all of that <laughs> So yeah, that's it. That, those are the three major things that I am never trying again. Never. Never ever. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comment section below. Will you be trying any of these three products again? Have you tried them? Will you be willing to try them again? What are the good things about these products? These things that you've done that worked for you? Let me know in the comment section and I will see you in the next video. Bye! Don't forget to subscribe on your way out. Like and share to somebody today. Toodles!